from Indie Streaming News Leader. This is a WRTV update. Good afternoon to you. I'm Megan Shen with your top stories. Some Hoosier help is on the way to the Sunshine State ahead of Hurricane Ian's arrival in the Gulf Coast. Today, Indiana Task Force 1 was activated. 45 personnel and six support members will head to the south, and they will offer search and rescue help and other types of aid after the storm hits. The task force was initially staged in Alabama. They will later be assigned somewhere in Florida by authorities in that state. If you played Saturday's Powerball, you might want to check your ticket now. That's because you could be a winner. The Hoosier Lottery says five tickets in the state of Indiana are worth at least $50,000. A ticket worth $2 million was sold in New Albany. A ticket worth $1 million bucks was sold in Laurel. That's in Franklin County in eastern Indiana. In Johnson County, a ticket worth one hundred grand was sold in Greenwood. And two tickets worth $50,000 were sold here in Indianapolis. So here's a look at the winning numbers for Saturday's drawing. Three 9, 21, 24, 29, and the Powerball was lucky number 14. If you have one of the winning tickets, put it in a safe location immediately and consider talking with a financial advisor before claiming your prize. Todd. All right, temperatures today on the cool side will be about 10 degrees below normal as we'll top off in the low to mid 60s here across the area. A little bit of a breeze still today, but the good news is plenty of sunshine. This evening will drop down into the 50s fairly quickly under a mainly clear sky, and by the time we get to 11 p.m., we're in the 40s. Low temperatures tonight will be in the 40 to 45 degree range. So you definitely probably want to have the jacket once again for the day tomorrow. But tomorrow is another day that features a good amount of sunshine. Temperatures still only in the low 60s. Eventually, by the time we get to Friday in the weekend, more seasonable temperatures in the 70s return to the area. For more stories and weather you need to know, download the WRTV mobile app. Thanks for joining us.